This is sacred ground. You should not be here. Well, either leave or tell me what you want. Who are you? I was told to come here and speak to Daphne. So you're the one Thalia spoke of. And it was you who slew the unkillable? It was tough, but not unkillable. I'm Alexios. I'm Daphne, leader of the Daughters of Artemis. I have a task for you, if you're willing and able. When you put it like that, how could I not accept? There's a boar not too far from here. Kill it, then bring me its pelt. Is this what you wanted? By the gods! Truly, Artemis has brought us together! I'm eager to see how else you can surprise me. Oh? And what did you have in mind? <laughs> Many things. But first, to business. There are beasts that roam this world, but are not fully of it. They've been placed here by the gods as trials, as tests. These beasts are creatures like any other. The world is full of mysteries, but not everything unexplained is ordained by the gods. Perhaps before this is over, you will have a different opinion. What exactly do you want me to do? I want you to prove your worth in the eyes of Artemis and hunt these creatures. I don't need to prove my worth to anyone. Just tell me what's the reward. With each pelt you return, I will grant you a boon from Artemis. If you are able to slay all the beasts, well, let's say your relationship with the daughters of Artemis will be forever changed. All right, I'll do it. Now, just how many of these animals are there? Artemis has laid out eight trials, and you have already started the journey. Hunt down those that remain. How will I recognize the creatures? Oh, you'll know. Bring the pelts to me. I'll await your return with my sisters, the daughters of Artemis. I hope you don't make me wait too long to see your face again. Away we go!
I hope this oracle gives better news than the one in Sparta. Alexios, isn't this remarkable? We're so close to the gods, I can feel Apollo all around me. How did it go with Elpino? We can talk later in private. Who's this? Just a simple pilgrim. He just saw the oracle. I couldn't help but ask if she's as glorious as they say. Well, is she? She left me with more questions than answers. That's the oracle for you. Well, it's just he seemed interested in legends. Like you. I, I thought you might get along. How did it... You know my spear just by looking at it? You're more than some simple pilgrim. All things in Velfi are more than they appear. Even I. My name is Herodotus. I'm a storyteller. Or I was. This war is forcing us all to new extremes. <laughs> that much is true. Why are you hiding your identity? I'm here on behalf of a man in Athens. A very powerful man. We intend to finally end this war. You told me you came to ask the Oracle a personal question. War is personal, Barnabas. So, you came to seek the Pythia's guidance on how to end the war? I did. Though something is wrong in Delphi. Guards at every turn, people being turned away. You don't seem convinced the Pythia can be believed. What did she tell you? I asked her to show the path to the war's end. She said... Spring should not wish for winter, as it brings death with it. Such wisdom! I don't understand a word of it, but that's why she's in there and we're out here. I know a threat when I hear one. <laughs> you were on Kefalonia for too long. I have my own questions for the Pythia, but this line... I'll be an old man by the time I see her. You're joking! You carry more blades than a field of grass! I didn't come here to start trouble. Trouble? Just walk in! Who's going to stop you? The priest? <laughs> All right. But if things get out of hand, I'm blaming you, Varnavas. Is he not every bit as great as I said? Thanks for sharing. I find believing. Next battle, I'll find you right at his side. I'm here to see the Pythia. Only those chosen by the light of Apollo may enter. How does one get chosen? One goes to the back of the line, 
Do I look like someone who waits in line? Enter into the light of Apollo, the light that illuminates shadow. Choose your question wisely, mortal, for you have but one. Speak, truth seeker! I lost my mother when I was young. I have to find her. Where is she? It's you! From the visions! The child on the mountain! How could you know that? You need to leave. Now. Leave? Do you have any idea what I've been through to get here? Oh, but I do. While in Kausos, you didn't cower in the face of the priest. A child and her family still live thanks to you. But how? No one can hide from the light. Please. I've come this far. You must have the answers I seek. Child of the mountain, the cult of Cosmos have eyes everywhere. They will kill you. Cult of Cosmos? The Oracle has spoken! The prophecy is yours! You never answered my question! I'm not leaving until I get answers! Rotatos, you're still here. Where's Varnavas? He's gone back to your ship. You don't look happy with your prophecy. She... knew who I was. <laughs> She's the Pythia. It's her business to act like she knows you. That was no act. She said she had visions of me as a child on a mountain. What child hasn't stood on a mountain? I was thrown from that mountain. My life started and ended on that mountain. I'm telling you, she knew who I was, what I'd done. Tried to warn me. Warn you? About what? She mentioned the cult of Cosmos. Does this mean anything to you? I'd heard whispers. A cult unlike any other coming to their feet. But I paid them no mind. The Pythia seemed afraid of them. Guards took her away. Took her away? Then the whispers were true. If this cult has corrupted the Pythia, this is devastating news. Do you understand what this means? Through her, the cult controls the world. I need to speak with her when she's not so well protected. That would require a miracle from the gods. She is always protected. I'll find where the Pythia lives. And I will get answers. Alexios, don't forget. Brute force is useless when finesse is required. Ah, Mystios! Well, aren't you a sight to my aged eyes? Young, energetic. Perhaps I should just pay for your body instead of your help. Watch yourself. That's not my line of work. 
Oh, forgive me. I'm amazed the gods would send me someone so well suited to help me, but who is also so appealing to me physically. I'm glad to hear it. Korygos, my husband, is having some difficulties keeping up with my hunger for pleasure. I imagine any man would. Oh, I have many lovers, but he's my soulmate. When we're together, it's indescribable. Then don't describe it. When we were younger, we would run into the moonlit forest, shed our clothes, and pleasure each other until sunrise. Our howls of ecstasy would echo throughout the valleys. By the gods, woman. I said spare me the details. I wasn't expecting a tough-looking mercenary to be so squeamish about a little fun. What does this have to do with me? I've learned of a powerful elixir which, if consumed, will give someone the vigor and stamina of Eros. If you can gather me the ingredients, I can make it for my husband. All right, I'll find the ingredients, if you promise to keep your nocturnal activities to yourself. I have some drachmi, and Koragos has more. If you can bring me some bear scrotum and a deer tongue, I can make the elixir. Oh, is that all you need? Don't worry, I'll reward you well. I'm sure Koragos will be thankful also. I'll be back with the ingredients soon. Over here, you sp Malaka! <laughs> if it isn't the Eagle Barak himself! You got big since Kefalonia! And you got old, Fotios, the dog's breath. Last I saw you, I think I lit your ship on fire. <laughs> my ship and my beard! These days, thankfully, I've semi-retired. <laughs> Do people pay mercenaries here more than they did in Kefalonia? <laughs> <laughs> of course they do! Better than Marcos, that's for sure. Everyone pays more than Marcos. You're lucky I took all his crazy contracts. <laughs> I was a false learner. He's a rotten cheat. I only accept the easy stuff now. I'm working as a watchman this very moment. A cushy job. Most days. I could use a break myself. <sighs> Some break this is. Today feels just like old times. The job got harder than anticipated. Did something happen? <sighs> a couple of priests ransacked this treasury. They took the Zaphires offered by a Thracian king. The bastards. <laughs> Your employer won't like that. No, but you like this. Make an example of the thieves. You find them and the Zaphires, and I'll pay you much better than you're used to in Kefalonia. 
All right, I'll help you. But... But what? I haven't forgotten the old days. I owe you one, Fortios. No reward necessary. <laughs> ha! I thought I was getting soft. Shouldn't be long before I find them. This must be the cave Photios mentioned. Those priests came this way. One of the priests, but no sign of the sapphires. Agreement in full. Treasury sapphires to be sold at no discount. Meet at Desvina Port for the sale. Well, I know where I'm headed next.
awful. Who would drink an elixir made from this? I see them. Try to stay out of sight. Yeah! 
bit of blood on them, but the sapphires still shine. No! I will kill you quick! <laughs> <laughs> Ella. Sanctuary of Delphi. The gods themselves.
Good news. Found the sapphires. Should I ask why they're bloody? The priests couldn't cut it as thieves. <laughs> you said you'd do it for free. But we both know that was horseshit. <laughs> Here, take this. Here, old man. <laughs> Here's a little trinket from the treasury. No one will miss it. Let's hope not, or you'll send another mercenary after me. <laughs> Goodbye, Fotios. <laughs> if you ever see that dog Marcos again, <laughs> tell him you demand minimum wage. Careful. High security here. I'm not here to hurt you. I just want answers. The Pythia is a sacred vessel of the gods. People travel the world for my answers. But none of them would dare break into my home. Apollo's wrath will be cruel and swift. Guards! Enough with your lies. Tell me what I want to know. I can't... Breathe! <laughs> if you raise your voice, if you tell a lie, I will cut your throat. I'm dead already. They'll find out you were here, and they'll kill me for it. Who? This cult of Cosmos? Speak! Yes, the cult wants you dead. They know you're here. You have an opportunity to do the right thing. Tell me where to find the cult. Tell me where they are, or we'll go find them together. Beneath the Temple of Apollo, there is an ancient chamber. I think they meet there. But without one of their cloaks and masks, you won't make it more than two steps inside. Where can I find one of these cloaks and masks? There is a man. He visits me from time to time, makes sure I'm well taken care of. I have the biggest house in the Hora of Delphi, yet he still offers Drachmi for my troubles. Gives me the creeps. What's his name? Elpinor. Elpinor? He's with the cult? I can't be sure, but if he is, he would definitely have what you require. I sent Elpinor to the Underworld. I knew the mask I stripped from his corpse would come in handy. Now go! You bring nothing but darkness with you. I should tell Herodotus what the Pythia told me about the cult. Maybe he'll have some insight.
Well, what did the Pythia tell you? The cult of Cosmos is hunting me, but I'm going to hunt them first. She told me they meet in a secret chamber under the Temple of Apollo. So it's all true. If the cult has done anything, it's fooled this old man. I've killed the first cultist, Elpinor, a snake I met in Cephalonia. His mask and cloak will get me inside the chamber. So they're underneath the Temple of Apollo? Yes, by the Cave of Yea. I think I know the place. Find it, and I'll meet you there. Come on! So, this is it. Hidden chamber of the cultists. Here, all along. I'm going inside. Keep my clothes for me. Best not to go in with your weapons, either. I don't think they'll look too kindly on that. How do I look? Terrifying. Good. Find me once you've found out the truth in there. Keep your wits about you. Try not to do anything rash. Me? Rash? Who thought these ridiculous costumes were a good idea? Demos hasn't arrived yet. Sorry, it's my uh, first time. A new recruit? <gasps> welcome, welcome. I'll go talk to the others. 
Thank you. Yes, yes, before Demos comes. Who knows if you'll get a word in after that. All right, then. Highest bid the for a little match, bro. You're not listening. <laughs> I'm still not convinced. You. We need another opinion on this. Why split resources searching for a woman we can't find? If we narrow our focus, Athens will be ours. Immediate threats have to be destroyed. Pericles has to be destroyed. Not without the mother. We aren't strong enough without the mother. Don't let Demos hear that. If anything, we should be hunting the father. <sighs> we know who the mother is. Looking for the father would be a waste of resources. What do you think? Hunt the champion's mother or her father? The mother. He's right. Get your priorities straight. Before you know it, Pericles will shore up his defenses and we will have lost our chance. Now, if you'll excuse me. I I'll need much more information to identify well, who these cultists are. Wrong. We need to look for the father. only blood right now, but who knows? Ramos may ask for our hands next. Go on, go on! Make your offering! We just have to keep our sights on what the bloodline will do for us. The bloodline? The mother, the father, the brother. You know, her kin. We need them. All of them. To use them? That information is not for Demos, of course. You know how volatile she is. She could rip through us easily. I'll be sure to keep it to myself. As you should. Nor can she know we're about to capture her mother. <laughs> I have to go. To our great ambition. To ambition. face so sad like the tragic mask of Melpomene your family is safe for now just just don't touch them don't hurt them that is up to you but I know you will hate because you know their fates if you don't please don't we will kill them your wife your child and then what would you have to live for nothing exactly Letters to and from the cult. Gods. They have a foothold in every part of the Greek world. We're in more danger than I thought.
yourself together, Malaka. You're a fucking pig before slaughter. I'll do it, I swear. I'll kill him. Let me go. You like to watch, you sick fuck. You're not just going to watch. You're going to teach this little insolent shit a lesson. I... Show him what happens to cowards. They get fucking burned. Hand it to me. <laughs> no! No! <laughs> More? No. I'll go to Athens. I'll stake out the temple. I'll kill him. Good. And don't waste my fucking time again. It's strange. Fuck like that again, and I I'll draw blood. Feel something towards now the pyramid. The it's covered in shards, like Alpinors. Ah, you had the last piece. Now it is ready. Every time I see it, it calls to me and sings of power. Does it call to you like it calls to me? It does. What are you doing? Have you lost your mind? I... No. She hasn't even arrived yet. Gather yourself and hold your tongue, fool. Show respect for the bloodline. Elpinor is dead. One of you is a traitor. The artifact will expose them. You! Ah. Everyone will be tested. You first. Go.
You're alive. There were people in the temple. I couldn't see their faces. They... Herodotus. They control all of the Greek world. Everything. I see. It's worse than I thought. There's more. They have a weapon. What? Kind. A soldier, stronger and more ferocious than any I've ever seen. Herodotus, it's my sister. We need to get to Athens. Athens? We need to find my mother. My clothes. Spear. Uh, uh, of course. My spear! The cult of Cosmos called my sister, Vimos. She used an artifact to see my memories. Alexios, the man I serve, we must tell him what's happened before it's too late. You've heard the name Pericles before. Pericles is the great general leading the Delian League against the Spartans. They say he's ruthless. We aren't leading the League against anyone. Pericles is a man of peace. This war was thrust upon him. Upon us all. A general who doesn't want war? Not likely. Save your doubts. He is working to end this war. We all are. If there are forces colluding against him, he must be warned. We have to go. To Athens? They're hunting my family, my mother. I have to find her. You carry the blade of Leonidas. Act like it. If Pericles doesn't put an end to this war, we're all as good as dead. Including your mother. Fuck your war! The cultists are exterminating my family! You have a duty to the Greek world. We both do. Pericles must be warned. She is my mother. What would you have me do? If there is one place where we can find information about your mother, it is in Athens. How? Pericles surrounds himself with the brightest minds in Athens. Which is to say anywhere. In Athens, you can fulfill your duty to your family. 
But before we can go, I need you to meet me at the Lion of Leonidas, at Thermobile. Leonidas? Why? There's something I need to know. Something that may help us take down this cult and save your mother. You've proven I can trust you. But let's make it quick, Herodotos. First to Romopoli, then we go to Athens. I'll make sure every single one of these cultists dies by my hand.